guys, it's Andrea, and today I'm going to be doing a plan with me, a sped up one. You guys have seeming to be okay with these, and this is by Rosie Plans. This was her mystery kit, which also came with this planner clip that I have on my planner, and then also a fox planner clip that's more like of a cardboard style. Um, I'm going to be using this kit in a faux plan with me, a fast kind of one, um, just to show you guys how far I can make this kit go. I do have a, a sheet of eight ombre art checklists, then there are half boxes, quarter boxes, some mini checklists, to-do boxes, and then two pieces of washi on the bottom. There's two pieces of washi down here, and then a bunch of heart checklists, two weekend banners, and then a bunch of headers. Then you have a bunch of various little things there. Then you have this bottom washi, when I, which I mentioned in my plan, no, my Etsy haul, that I didn't really love this bottom washi, but I think that it makes up for it in these adorable full boxes. I actually wanted to use this in my real planner, but there's just so many spreads in February. Like, I think I've had more of like planner struggles when it comes to come like trying to narrow, narrow down the amount of February spreads I have I thought de December was really bad with that but January is way worse so I'm gonna go ahead and link her shop down below and I'm just gonna get right on it Okay, let's talk about it. So first off, let's talk about how stinking cute this turned out. Like, can you guys resist this? So there are some pros, there are some cons. So the first thing that I want to talk about are the cons because there's way more pros. There's way more pros than there are cons. So the cons for me and the things that I would want to see more of are I'd like to see some kind of like icons, like icon circles. Other than that, like as far as the kit, there's nothing that I would necessarily add. I really think that there's a good amount of littles. I think there's a good amount of heart checklists. I think maybe instead of the one week extra weekend banner, we could throw some extra icons in there and maybe like or even ha or even maybe you know here and here throw some circle icons and this kit is like the bomb but I do have to say though as far as that 
if it didn't change, I'm a thousand percent satisfied. That's just my like suggestion. The other thing that I do want to note is on some of the stickers, mostly my headers, which I don't, the pink ones were fine, but the orange ones weren't. They were cut a little off, so it had a little bit, here's an example. It had a little bit, no, it's not a good example. Um, I had a little bit of white space on it. I don't really know if I'm going to be able to find one. I know it doesn't bother me. I do know from experiences with customers, though, that it sometimes bothers them. It's really hard to see. Uh, a little bit of extra white space on the bottom of the today. Um, so it doesn't bother me, but it does bother some people. So that's just something to note. Um, it was only really on the headers, though. And then on some of the littles, it was on the side. And then on the headers, it was on the bottom area of the littles. So you can see that there's color on the tops and all both of the sides. But then on the bottom, there's no color because that's where it cut off and the white would be. And then the same thing with these orange Littles here, the sides had a little bit of white on them. So if that doesn't bother you, then that is not a problem. Um, the other thing is, is that it's too cute. It's too cute, guys. Like, I didn't want to put anything over these because they're so cute. And that is definitely not a con. I just thought it'd be funny to throw it in the con pile. But that is everything. Like, as far as, like, cons, like, there is no other cons. I just think it turned out super stinking freaking cute. Sorry, I had to use that word. Um... I really like it. I actually didn't mind this bottom washi once I put my little check boxes over it. That's I said, that's when my first initial thing was that I didn't like, but I don't mind that. So realistically, there's nothing wrong for me at all. I like everything. There's nothing that I would really change. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I had left. I had one full box left. I opted to do the heart checklist on the top. If I would have did the ombre checklist on the top here, I probably would have put this extra checklist as well as some washi on the sidebar. But I had one extra one of these because of that. I had four extra ombre heart checklists. I have five extra little things. I just have a couple, like six stickers here. I have a couple extra washies here. And then I have all of these heart checklists just because I don't really use these. But I do know people that do use them. And then a couple of, like, little guys down here. But other than that, like, I'm just, like, loving this. Like, I just can't. I don't think that I've loved another kit as much. And it hasn't been as easy to plan with another kit as it was with this one. So definitely check out Rosie Plans. I loved this mystery kit. I'll definitely get her next month's mystery kit. I got another kit from her that was just like one that was in stock in the shop. And it, was, it wasn't it was my favorite. I definitely prefer the selection that comes in the mystery kits. So I'll continue to purchase those. So let me know what you think. Definitely check her out. If you purchase from her, definitely let, let her know that I sent you. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!